Oh, hello there. So, let's do a concealer collection. I think from you guys probably watching some of my these collection videos, you're going to probably see what I like and what I don't like and probably what could be decluttered or not decluttered in future videos, you know what I mean? Because there will be decluttered videos. So, concealer. First concealer, which is by far my favorite one I own so far, is the Dior Forever Skin Correct. Forever Skin Correct from Dior. I have the shade. Tell me the shade. 1CR. So here is a swatch. That's that. You guys are gonna love it when I get to my lip swatches for my collections because I will be swatching everything I can. Oh, go ahead and swatch. I do have two discontinued. What the heck? Do I know? Oh, there it is. Okay. So I don't forget these. Is I have a ColourPop No Filter Concealer for zero zero. I use this for cutting my creases. That's that one. And then I have Too Faced, Born This Way, in the shade Swan. J-Cat Stay, Stay Sure, it is the shade Porcelain. I use this for cutting my creases as well. I don't know, I could probably use it underneath my eyes too. I might have to try that one of my darker foundations. Yeah, Tarte Creaseless Concealer in the shade 13N. So we we will baby. We have Tarte. It's Shape Tape Glow Wand. I, I actually like this one. In the shade Sunbeam. Got this in my boxy charm. ColourPop Pretty Fresh and Hyaluronics in the Fair 07C. I think that's what it says. It's got a lot of numbers. Here's this one swatched. Wet and Wild. It's the Mega Mega Last Incognito All Day Coverage. It's in the shade Fair. favorite drugstore ones right there. I do have three like potted ones. Do those last. We have Morph 2 Hide and Hide and Peak Concealer Corrector in the shade Peak of Fawn. Sometimes some a lot of these that look dark were ones that looked lighter in the picture. We have Tarte C Hyd Hyd Hydro Concealer. I got a lot of Tarte Concealers. I got three of them, I think. Wow. Must be like in Tarte. It's a Tarte Hydro Concealer in the shade 14 in Fairlight Neutral. That looks darker in the packaging, though, huh? It comes out light on the skin. We have NYX Born to Glow Radiant Concealer. And this is in the shade. Tell me the shade. Alabaster. I heard it. It's on the lid. Why would I? I wouldn't think to look there. I forgot this was a puffy one. Let's see. If I, there we go. It's the shade Alabaster. Yeah. It is Maybelline Instant Age Rewind and Facer Corrector Multi Use in the shade 100 Ivory. Ooh, I don't think I've used this one yet. I have not. Let's get it. Come on, get up here. Yeah, it's coming out. It's like two seconds here. Can we get it now? There we go. That's that. One of my favorite, this is what started the whole concealer obsession right here. Is the Fenty Beauty Matchstick in the shade Ivory. I need to re-pull this one out. 
This started the concealer under my eyes because I love this under my eyes. Okay, I have two Kylie's. Uh, I got one free and I bought one on sale. So we have the shade Stone. And then the shade Pearl. I bought Stone and got Pearl for free. Figured if I was going to get a free one, I'd get one in a different tone to use. Elf Hy Hydrating Camo Concealer in the shade Fair Warm. Big dough foot. Another morph. Yeah, another morph one. It's in the shade C00. It's a white one. And I use this to cut my creases. This is gonna be, she's gonna be getting to empty. I use this a lot. But recently though, I've been obsessing over the ColourPop one. We have Fenty Beauty here. It's their Bright Fix Eye Brightener Illuminating Concealer. It's in the shade Golden Ivory too. This is a real nice one. Let me see, oh. Okay, so I do have two. Okay, I have one color corrector. It's the Dragon Beauty Dragon Dragon Fire color corrector in the shade Lavender. And I have not used this one because I'm not for sure how I would use. Do I use a color corrector with a concealer? Do I use it under, then I'm doing my foundation, and then my concealer? Oh, you know what? I'm about to try that like that. That's that. And then we have Becca, the under eye corrector. I wanted to try this for the hype, because this, this just gets so much hype. So, that is the shade light to medium. You ever know when something gets like so hype, you're like, oh god, let me try that. That's, what, that's what's happening there. <laughs> Two more left. Too Faced. It's in the Peach Concealer. It's matte instant coverage in the shade Petal. I don't think they make this anymore, but that's what she looks like on the inside. The Wee Wood. Ooh. This is a nice one. Need to get more face brushes. And the last one I have is the Kevin Aquan. It's in the shade S. It's a sensual skin enhancer. You know, color or not color concealer there. In the shade SX07. That's what she looks like on the inside. I'm gonna bust this one back out. I haven't used it in a while. Here is what she looks like. That's my concealer collection. I know. So that's a heck of a lot of concealers there. I told you, I, had a, I have a problem. <laughs> oh, when I, you see me do this, just know I wear daily glasses, okay? I just take them off to film and take pictures. <laughs> All right, thanks for watching. Hope to see you in my next one. Bye.